Hey YouTube, this is Unconnected007, and today I am going to show you how to delete a virus um, using a program called MSoft, and this is used for when Windows will not load up and you can't log on to your Windows account. So, the first thing you want to do is go to start and go to your internet browser. for it to load <clears throat> sorry it's kinda slow alright now you want to search up MSoft first link okay and now you want to go to downloads now you want to scroll down till you find something called MSOF command line scanner this is free should be a quick download click open alright let that download I'm going to pause the video till that is finished. Alright YouTube, now that we are back, um, you can see the file on my desktop is a RENRAR file. And when you, um, make sure you have WinRAR when you download this or after, because you will need WinRAR to open it. It's a free download, just search it on Google, whatever. Alright, so you want to double click it to open it. Come on. Alright, and you'll see all these files in here. Just leave them for now, minimize it, and go to start. Go to my computer. And then go to local disk C. And in here, you want to create a new folder. and name it emergency it doesn't have to be that name I just do it this way so it stands out so I would recommend it alright double click it to open it and now pull the WinRAR back up and click or highlight all these files click extract to and you want to extract it to the folder emergency or whatever you named it so C emergency alright and then it will extract to emergency this shouldn't be too long um, take maybe a couple of minutes and I will pause the video till this is finished alright this is almost finished downloading and there we go alright so it should be in that emergency folder you can close WinRAR and now you want to you can close this emergency folder so you don't need to use this unless you get a virus and you can't start up Windows so I am going to show you an example um, so if you're starting Windows and you're trying to load on um, and it won't let you load on you restart your computer and you tap F8 um, it, or yeah, it should be F8. Um, 
F2, um, I'm not sure. All computers are different. So it's restarting, and I will be tapping F8 for this one to load up the. So as soon as it turns on, be tapping F8. Or it starts to turn on. And this is taking forever, sorry about that. Alright, so once it's loaded, you want to be tapping F8. Ah, oh, I missed it. So tap F8 right now. Okay, and there we go, basically. So far, um, as you can see, um, there's a whole bunch of options when you tap F8. You want to go all the way up to the top of the arrow key that says Safe Mode with Command Prompt. Press Enter, press Enter again, and it will go to Safe Mode. And the only thing you will be able to access is command prompt. Alright, so it's basically in safe mode right now. And it will be like normal Windows starting up. Um, Alright, so I'm going to do administrative administrator so it'll look like normal startup um, but it'll say safe mode and all you'll get is this command black box um, the first thing you want to do is go to um, your C drive so you type CD slash press enter and you can type DIR so you can see where all your files are and as you can see right here there's a file called emergency so you want to type change directory CD and then type emergency Alright, now you are in emergency, so you can type DIR to see all the files. And this is the one we want to be used, a2cmd.exe. So you want to type that, a2cmd.exe. And then it will give you a whole bunch of list of options. Alright, so here are all the options. You can see there's deep, um, smart, and quick scan. Um, I'm just going to do a quick for this video um if you do slash m it'll scan memory slash t for traces and slash c for cookies um if you scroll down there's um her heuristic um unknown malware r a archive n and you can do delete or quarantine um so let's do a2 cmd dot exe you have to type this and we're going to do a quick for this tutorial so slash quick now you want to do slash m slash m slash t slash c um slash h r slash h slash h slash r slash a and then slash n And then I'm going to do slash D for delete. So it will delete these files after it has finished. So press enter. You want to be careful with the delete because you do not want it to delete um, the Windows files on your computer. Press enter and it will do its whole scan thing. See, it will start going. So it's And you can see that it's scanning. And now it is almost done.
and that's basically it um it will go through that and um you can just see um it'll start it'll scan faster and it will say it deleted the viruses it won't i'm sure i won't detect any and um this is unconnected double seven thanks for watching um please rate subscribe and comment and tell me what you think i use this i know it works and i would recommend it so thanks for watching